Hello again. Uh, today I would like to um, update you guys on a few things that I'm doing uh, with my Beautiful You program. Um, I'm going to talk a little bit about here in the beginning about the rain that's been happening and how it's been maybe affecting me on this way. Um, I think one of uh, my spirits are a little bit uh, down I think but I think maybe that's lack of sunshine you know and being able to uh, go outside and do some biking or walking and stuff like that has been um, kind of interesting so I thought I would mention that first and I hope the sun comes out here shortly for everybody involved and uh, then that way we can uh, get out there enjoying um, southern Alberta and all its sunshine again so um, the other thing I want to mention was um, with doing all this exercise and maybe eating a little bit more proper it's um, my sleep has changed like I am just out by 10 o'clock I have the best sleeps ever and at 6 30 in the morning I'm still zonked you know but uh, I think that's great so uh, there's a really good benefit to, to going through all this and uh, it, I feel really good in the morning though when I wake up I feel energized again and uh, ready to accomplish another day so uh, the gym, I've been keep going to the gym and the guys there are great. They're working um, Mondays. I do upper body uh, muscles and uh, exercises and then Tuesday I do lower and then Friday it's all all round. It's cardio and, and weights all put together and uh, that one's a very hard one. So uh, Friday mornings are always interesting. So I met with uh, Marge again, and uh, she's uh, the life coach, and she uh, we just talked about um, basically planning, lots of planning, like schedule things in so that your life is organized and that you get things done on time, and uh, and then don't divert from it too much. You know that she mentioned there will always be things that yeah there is diversions in life. You know, but. Uh, even being a stay-at-home mom and stuff like that, you still got to get things done during the day so that you're prepared for when the kids come home and uh, you can enjoy life with them and help them out. And And I think that was uh, very good advice. So um, definitely trying to write down as much as I can and make time to fit everything in. And um, I've been uh, having a few meetings a little bit with the Lethbridge Herald to keep them up to date and, uh, and so they keep the articles uh going and uh, I think that's been uh, excellent and again uh, lots of interesting comments from people uh, everywhere I go I get people oh you're the beautiful you candidate so exciting so again we'll talk to you next week thanks